Hallia Chief Minister Conrad Sangma today tweeted that he held a meeting with senior officials of the state to evaluate the issues related to the Umiyam Bypass Bridge. He wrote, and I quote, discussed logistical and alternative arrangements taking into account sustainability and safety aspects while ensuring traffic is maintained and no further damage done to the bridge. As the nationwide farmers protest against the three farm laws continues, the Meghalaya Congress also held the protest in the state capital earlier today. The party demanded for the repeal of the three farmers' laws stating that it was against the interests of the farmers. Congress MLA Amperin Lingdok questioned the government of India as to why multinational corporations are being permitted to enter the agriculture sector. She added that farmers of Meghalaya will soon understand why there is a need to protest these laws, adding that the state government has to come up with a regulated market system in the state so that farmers won't be deprived of minimum support price. Did the government of Meghalaya ask even one farmer what they feel about these newly enacted laws? They are saying that there are no mandis in Meghalaya. But why are the farmers where the Mondays are working very well in other parts of the country protesting? If there were regulated markets, there will be no middlemen who will deprive farmers of their common, common minimum support price. The Ministry of Textiles has sanctioned 18 crores for the development of an apparel unit in Ampati, out of which 14 crores has been utilized for the development of infrastructure for the unit, informed Chief Minister Conrad Sangma earlier today. He tweeted, and I quote, We are building a unique brand for Meghalaya and we are exploring options to promote value chain. Employees of the Maumulu Chera Cements Limited today held a protest in Shillong. The MCCL Employees Union demanded for release of pending salary from November 2015 to March 2016. Release of salary from the month of February of this year till date and payment of overtime charges for 2013 till date. Errors of payment revision from April 2018 till date and medical reimbursement and other welfare facilities. Meghalaya today observed the 58th Raising Day celebrations of the civil defense and home guards in various parts of the state. Addressing the civil defense and home guards officers, jawans and guests at CD and HG Parade Ground Maud Yangdiang, AR Mautho, Commandant General of Home Guards and Director of Civil Defense, said that the state government has sanctioned eight additional new posts of the Deputy Controllers of Civil Defense and Staff for new District Home Guards Training Centers in Nongpo, Nongstoin, Mongkorwat, Kleariat, William Nagar, Bakmara, Rasubalpara and Ampati during the current financial year.